after seeing the distribution of the delegates, I can happily say that we are leaving Iowa victorious because they had like 30 delegates given to them, but there are 41 delegates. So does that mean I have 11 delegates, which means I'm tied for first place? Mm. I don't know. That'd be crazy. All right. So I feel like I've been a little rough on the old timers because I'm a new timer and I think the president should speak computer. Like, what are you going to do your first day in office? Actually, before I'm actually president, I'm going to go hang out with the NSA and I'm going to go code with them and I'm going to go see what they do. And then I'm going to do that the next day and I'm going to do that for like a month and I'm going to go get trained by the people that write the pres president's daily briefing and um, that's going to be my well it, I'll do that in the morning well I'll do that whatever hours they work and then the other hours I'll interview people for jobs because I, I'm going to have to fill a lot of positions so um, yeah that's my plan because I can speak computers and people don't understand that in the war on terror and the war on everything on, on the survival of our people um, it, it matters if you can speak computers and I, I think a lot of people right now are like I'm at the top of a tech company and I'm just now realizing I don't even know what a computer does and that's why right now no matter how much of a, a fraud I feel like acting like I know about computers because computers are that big, I do know what a computer does. And I, I think that matters. I, I, I actually think, especially in a lot of positions, it matters if you can understand, that it, under, it matters that you understand what a computer does. And I think the real problem that some of these CEOs are facing is that they don't understand that it matters if you understand how bubbles work and I think a lot of people are really um, showing off their ability to um, have a very high valuation in their stock um, because they want to defend it when it's so high but I don't think you understand like the height of your defense um, can get really 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 dangerous um, but I guess Maybe you do, but I don't think you do. And that's why, you know, no matter what I say about me being a new timer, like I, I, I speak computers, I need the old timers. And that's why Warren Buffett is someone that can actually explain that sort of thing to me. Um, Bill Gates, odd enough, can, can actually explain that sort of thing to me because he lived through the tech bubble and all the other bubbles. Um, I mean, so, you know, there's a reason I want to pair new timers with old timers, but then for a lot of decisions, I do think it makes sense that we need new timers making decisions um, because new timers actually understand the decision they're making. And a lot of the time, the top guy in the computer world isn't the guy that should be making decisions. And the old timer just agrees with them because they have no idea what the new guy, what the new timer is saying. Um, and that's why it's important to know the new timer, like know the guy that actually can understand the code and that's why you know what it what is your first hundred days look like it's it's a lot of um, talking about code um, it's a lot of uh, it's a lot of talking about um, computer program like what the what computer programs can do and stuff like that um, and it's it's a lot talking about what computer programs like have done like what what they've accomplished um, I have said it before, I'm for AI drones. I, I'm for humanless planes, every type of plane that is better than a human. Um, why? Because why wouldn't I want to beat them? Um, because I, I, especially when I know what the code says, if you, if you understand the code, you're not like, the computer is going to go and decide to want to cuddle with me and then I don't want to be friends with it and then it might actually try to take oil from me and I won't know what to do. And it's a lot easier. Um, 
if you understand that the code isn't a human and it's not until you get deep enough into AI that you're like, okay, AI is not that smart, but it's scary because humans are smart and AI helps humans. And it's, it's really hard to explain that, but, um, um, that's the real problem with everyone involved in the race is from Harvard or they're <laughs> combined with probably, um, Jewish or Catholic, one of the two, not in the race, but in power, it's like, it's weird, but, um, it's really weird, especially because the, the amount of lawyers and, and judges, like the people that are making moral decisions for us all from the same place. And, and it, it, it's a place that has very much shown that the words of the constitution don't matter. So I don't know. All right, I'm out of here.